Hello. Hello. How are you? Good. Doing pretty good. Okay. And <laughs> we're here Ke in Copenhagen. Yeah, you are. I'm ready to get some change. And Kevin, uh, tell us who you are and what you are. Um, my name is Kevin Buckland. I'm the art ambassador with 350.org. Um, and I'm here with all sorts of youth from all over the world as part of the UN youth delegation. And we're going to participate in this giant rally march wonderful thing tomorrow. Um, so we decided that penguin costumes were obviously necessary um, and even more necessary was a little penguin dance. Um, so I'll, I, I'll sh just give you a quick little show around the space because it's pretty cool. Now tell us again what this is specifically. This is a... This is this is the art build space. So this is the place where a lot of the banners and actions coming out of um, the, the COP um, actually happen. So, so when we hear about dancing trees and all that kind of good stuff, it's all built here. Um, I won't say all of it, but the, the, there's, a, there's, a, there's a big contingency of people doing stuff pretty much all the time. You know, I do this for my mom around my house. Just, you know, I Skype call my mom and like I show around my house, sort of like what you're doing right now. Yeah, cool. <laughs> That's great. Um, yeah, so we've got right here, we also happen to have two rapping penguins who might want to do a little bit of their rap, if, that, if that's cool. Of course, but first, just you got to give us a little bit of detail. So tell us a little bit about 350 and what you guys are doing there. Okay. Um, 350 is an international uh, organization that organized um, on October 24th the largest day of political action in history, or most widespread, 180 actions. Um, people joining all together, calling for action. Um, that will set a limit, a cap of CO2 in the atmosphere at 350 parts per million. Scientists say, almost all the scientists agree, that as we go above 350 parts per million, um, we're getting in the red zone, we don't really know what's going to happen, and we're increasing the risks of severe climate damage. Um, and so what are you, what are you guys actually doing at Copenhagen? You guys had a big march, was it today or is it tomorrow? Um, big march tomorrow, um, 350's here. We're basically trying to make sure that 350 stays in the text. Um, there's a lot of Euro Europe and a lot of the G8 nations are trying to get it out. But we have support from, I believe, over half the nations involved that actually want a treaty that limits CO2 at 350 parts per million. And this weekend, um, we're having candlelight vigils all over the world to show solidarity um, and get the eye back here on Copenhagen and show really the seriousness of what's happening here. Um, <laughs> Seri and, serious like a penguin costume. <laughs> and I just have to ask, you know, like when you guys are in your planning meetings and you're sitting there and you're like, all right, I mean, I imagine that most of what you guys do is to try to get, you know, attention. It's like, how do you, how do you know which ideas to go with and which ideas to pass over and how do you pick what you're going to do? Um, well, there's a lot of like boards and committees and things, but here at the art space, we sort of just, whoever starts making it, it gets made. And, um... <laughs> And, and that, that, that's what ends up happening. Um, and um, kind of where, where the will is, uh, the way it comes out. And like, this penguin idea started from a brainstorming session at the COI, the Conference of Youth, that happened this weekend, where youth from all over were participating in some act, art, artivist, so activist art workshops, um, doing song and dance and street theater uh, with some great folks from Bread and Puppet Theater. Um, yeah. <laughs> So you guys have a dance for us, or a rap, or...? Yeah, yeah, we've got a dance. Well, we'll jump to a little bit of the rap, and then we're going to break into the penguin dance. How, oh, how's that sound? That sounds great. All right, so I would like to introduce to you our two penguin rappers! Uh, let's hear it. All right, so can you guys clap along? So. <laughs> I'm making a case for my phone no oasis Before Gaia starts with a homeostasis No homes will be safe from the loneliest place To the inner city's pool, there'll be bones in the grave We're meddling, the CO2 tumors enveloping You can watch your malignant melanin developing It's endemic, I see the end and it's imminent This volatile world reflects our lost innocence Slim picking, sinning to the persistent sibilance Appeasing our greed, the planet's turned militant Time to call the bluff Surely one fool's enough It's not about we and they It's about all of us Piling on the wicker from our privileged nations Burning in the flicker of civilization Modern Prometheus Turning up the Celsius Time for a change Your choice if you're helping us or melting us Spontaneous combustion A thousand species lost to the thirst of consumption 
Bombay to LA, Beijing to London, the pistons are pumping so our minds can't function. Feel the heat. I'm sweating in the street and unsettled in my sleep. It's a wrestle with the beast. Stepping on the beat with the viral. Trying to get heard before Gaia turns pyro. So turn it, turn it, turn it down before we burn it. Burn it, burn it down. We need to turn it, turn it, turn it round before you see Gaia choking your whole puffin' smoke. <laughs> wow. Thank oh, you, guys. If you can't stand the heat, then get out of the kitchen. But you're burning fossil fuels, man. You best stop bitching about the temperature rising and start devising a way to cool down that setting sun on the horizon. I'm advising all of y'all to step back, stand up, supersizing all of the mistakes that we make. Start recognizing that the lifestyles we live come with consequence. And confidence and common sense won't be a strong enough defense against the shit that goes down while you're sitting on the fence watching CO2 fill the atmosphere until it's dense. In the present tense, we got to ensure the future presidents are hesitant by following destructive precedents that are set when politicians forget future generations gonna be upset when they're handed down our debt yeah they'll regret that they let them okay guys we actually have to go on to our next person ah hate to cut you all off all right all right thank you so very much cool thanks for the performance oh uh, uh, no no worries uh, we have a little penguin dance too, but if we're short on time, I, I think we have to, we uh, got we we have our next we're scheduled. You know, this is all high tech and scheduled. Um, yeah, using internet and buttons. And things. Yes, yes. So thank you guys cool. so very much. We really appreciate it, and um, we look forward to hearing more as you go along. All right. Yeah, we'll stay tuned. We'll we'll try to get you some footage from the march tomorrow. That sounds great. All right. Say goodbye, penguins. Bye bye. Bye. Thank you.